Hi guys, I am Ilhan Farisi. So today, I would like to talk about how artificial intelligence for learning and teaching. I will show you what is artificial intelligence. Let's go start it. Artificial intelligence. Well, As artificial intelligence is artificial the intelligence. Artificial intelligence, how we I know about AI, is the ability a computer or the machine to imitate human intellect. In the processing of information, learning patterns and making wise judgments or taking wise actions. Algorithms, mathematical models, and sophisticated computations are used in AI to create intelligent and adaptable behavior. It includes a broad range of methods and strategies intended to let computer carry out operation that would typically require human intellect. Why is artificial intelligence so important? Because in it many major components. The following are some of the K of techniques. First, the primary area of artificial intelligence that enables computers to learn from data without explicit programming is machine learning. Machine learning uses training data to find specific patterns or roles using algorithms. The computer can anticipate the future or making judgment based on these patterns. Second is neural networks. Artificial neural networks were influenced by the compositions and operations of the human brain, made up of the number of small processing units called neurons and coupled by connections that can change their strengths and weight. The third is natural language processing. Natural language processing is the particle of teaching computers to comprehend, process, and produce human language in a natural manner. Applications like chatbots, sentiment analysis, speech recognition, and machine translations all make us of natural language processing. Four is computer vision. It's a branch of artificial intelligence that gives computers the ability to comprehend and analyze visual data, including pictures and movies, image segmentation, fast detections, object recognitions, and other processes all rely on computer vision. And the last is robotics. Robotics develop automated system that can communicate with the physical environment by fusing AI with mechanics and electronics. Robotics is concerned with creating machines that can handle difficult tasks including navigations, object manipulations, and social interactions. The creations of artificial intelligence can be traced back to the early 20th century. Alan Turing questioned whether machines could think in the 1950s. The same year that John McCarthy, Marvin Mitsky, Nathaniel Rochester, and Claude Shannon conducted the Dartmouth Conference, which served as the formal inception of artificial intelligence. The idea has been around for a while and has seen significant grow up to the 2010s. Thanks to developments in speech recognition, picture recognition, and natural language processing. With the introduction of virtual assistant, product suggestions, driverless, fastless, and fast recognition, AI has become more relevant in daily life. In basic terms, AI can transform all aspects of our life by providing solutions that are smarter, more effective, and more flexible. To ensure the ethical and responsible use of AI, it is crucial to keep ethical and privacy concerns in mind during the development and implementations of the technology. 
holds a range of applications including feedback, reasoning, and adaptive learning. Artificial intelligence can be used into teaching and learning. Feedback is a key strategy for addressing learners' proximal learning habits, and AI can deliver prompt feedback in response to student input to support incremental access to abstract concepts and successful implementations of practical exercise. AI is used for reasonings, which entails explaining answers to issues and assisting pupils in comprehending difficult ideas. AI is used in adaptive learning to tailor each student's educational experience to meet their unique needs and learning preference. By doing its applications to encourage collaborations and knowledge organizations, touch swarm intelligence, artificial intelligence can be integrated into teaching and learning. This can change the role of teachers of knowledge transmissions to knowledge organizations. But it's crucial to remember that AI shouldn't take the position of teacher writers it should complement them and the human intellect. The implement of artificial intelligence in education should be based on learning theory to ensure its efficiency and accessibility. This will help content adapt to learners' pace, identify the learners' needs, and enable rapid data analysis to empower informed decisions. This will be done by assisting students in material mastery, repeating lesson as necessary, and quickly creating individualized learning plans for each student. As a virtual language component that may assist users in their English language learning, ChatGPT is one of the web artificial intelligence. ChatGPT is an AI model that can comprehend and produce genuine language, making it appropriate for interactively and engagingly practicing writing, grammar, and vocabulary. First is practice conversations. ChatGPT can create conversations script for many scenarios, allowing users to practice natural dialogue. Users have the options to read the discussions, listen to the language being used, and practice. Second is preparing for job interviews. ChatGPT simulates a job interview by having the user respond to questions provided by AI models. Users can get feedback on their response, which will aid them in getting ready for actual job interview. Next is vocabulary practice. Practice your vocabulary by asking ChatGPT for the definitions of specific terms or examples of persons that use those words. This aids in vocabulary growth and better comprehensions of word usage. Four is grammar review. ChatGPT can explain particular grammar sentences or forms. Additionally, users can re request example of paraphrases for a specific grammar structures and practice speaking those lines out loud or using text to speech software. Next is practice your pronunciations. Although ChatGPT does not over comments on pronunciations, user can ask it to produce paraphrases using particular sounds or phonetic patterns, giving them the opportunity to independently work on their pronunciations. 
artificial intelligence has made significant advancements and has the potential to revolution various industry. However, it also has its limitations and weakness. Here are some common weakness or limitations of artificial intelligence. The first is limited creativity. While AI can generate novel solutions based on patterns and data, it lacks true creativity and originality. It cannot re replicate the depth and breadth of human imaginations, artistic expressions, or innovations. Next is interpretability and explainability. Many AI algorithms such as deep neural networks operate as black box, making it difficult for humans to understand how they arrive at their decisions. This lack of interpretability can be problematic in critical domains like healthcare or finance where extensibility is necessary. Next is lack of common sense reasonings. Well, AI system excel at specific tasks within different parameters, they struggle with generalized common sense reasoning. They often struggle with understanding non set or ambiguous situations, which human can effortlessly navigate. Less for AI is full vulnerability to adversarial attack. AI models can be susceptible to adversarial attacks, where input data is simply modified to mislead the models. These attacks can exploit vulnerabilities and lead to incorrect or malicious outcome. And for ChatGPT, I have and I see the weakness. Here are some of weakness of ChatGPT. First is lack of deep context understanding. Although ChatGPT has extensive knowledge based on training data, it does not have a human-like deep understanding of context. This means that the model may produce answers that are not entirely relevant or may not understand curtain nuances in questions or statement. Second is vulnerable to inaccurate or out of that information. Chat GPT has no understanding of the actually full information. It is a knowledge based on the data that exists until September 2021. Therefore, the model might not be aware of current events or recent updates in various topics. And the last is tendency to generate overly recent response. Chat GPT may generate overly reassuring responses or provide incorrect information. User should always verify the information provided by Chat GPT with more reliable resources before making a decisions. This is all of weakness and limitation about artificial intelligence and chat GPT. In the broad terms, artificial intelligence has the ability to help teachers and students, open up new opportunities for students and learners, and offer solid technical support for individual learning. However, in order to adapt to this new era, policymakers and implementers on the ground must think uh, definitely and set up new mechanisms that have never been dreamed of before. In the future, there will still be good teachers who will lead uh, classes and to foster students emotive intelligence, creativity, and communications. It's all from me about artificial intelligence for helping learning and teachings. Thank you so much, have a good day, and see you! Thank you!